it's JP and welcome to the build where we show off the uh, latest stuff we have in development here at Retronyms. Uh, it's been a little while since I made one of these but I wanted to show off something. We just got this in the uh, office here and um, this is the latest uh, wedge prototype. Now I know it's missing the back half of the wedge. We just did a quick update on the rubber uh, housing to hold the, that holds the circuit board. So this is the final circuit board design. Uh, more or less, there might be one or two tweaks to it, and then this is kind of the, the uh, just checking the final uh, uh, prototype of how the rubber kind of wraps and holds the circuit board. So, um, and obviously, you know, this is uh, translucent rubber that helps us uh, uh, see the contents a little bit better. The final stuff will be gray, and obviously have the rest of the wedge coming off the back. Uh, so, a couple things. We showed a quick photo of this the other day, but you'll see there's two USB ports on one side now. This top one here is power for the iOS device. Um, and then on the other side, we have uh, two ports. This is the, the dedicated uh, AC adapter uh, power jack. And then uh, this is a controller port and another controller port. So we've added this power port. So now you can charge your iOS device while uh, uh, you have two controllers going. Um, but basically, yeah, you can just, we just got this in the office, I thought I'd share it. Uh, we will make a couple modifications to this, like, I don't know how well you can see it here, but um, this, these parts here where the circuit board has, has uh, these, these um, prongs coming out are, are making the rubber kind of bubble up here and here, uh, and we'll probably try to, I mean, we're definitely going to try to uh, uh, smooth that out. That shouldn't be too hard. We're either going to move that to the other side of the circuit board or, or allow for them in the, in, with like a gap in the rubber here. Uh, so you can see uh, kind of it fits in snugly. These, these USB ports are really, really nicely uh, snugly fit. And uh, that should be pretty nice. And actually I can show kind of, you can pop the circuit board out. So for all you hackers uh, who want to want to do some of that. Um, now this thing's remotely programmable. so. Uh, uh, you don't necessarily need to pull it out, but you'll be able to. Um, and who knows, uh, we may uh, actually do uh, alternate uh, casing colors or something. So uh, no promises yet, but um, that might be an option down the road. Uh, so you can see here again the final circuit board. I've showed a couple photos of this uh, last week, um, but you can sort of see it here. So this is a near final circuit board and then the rubber case here. Um, you know, this is a, again, it's a 3D printed mold uh, that then the silicone was hand poured into. So there's a lot of extra like uh, flashing here and, and you now all of these lines will be, be cleaned up too. So, um, you know, but this is just a, a sort of final check for us to make sure. You can see there's a little like rubber bracing here in the inside edge that kind of holds the board in place and then there's kind of a, a cavity behind it. So that's kind of the latest on Wedge. Um, one thing we're probably, you know, it's, we think it's really cool to see the sort of raw exposed circuit board in this thing, um, but we're, we are gonna be painting it. So like there'll be, a, we're gonna choose a different color and uh, uh, screening some, some sort of cool design on the front of this. So I hope to share those um, with you, some different options and maybe have the uh, people who pre-ordered uh, Wedge um, be able to maybe vote on which, which option is the coolest. Uh, so I may try to do that in a couple weeks uh, as we get closer to finalizing all of the uh, uh, final stages. Um, there's just a few steps left on our milestone list and uh, we'll be keeping you guys posted with all the progress. So there's the latest. Uh, I just wanted to give a quick, quick update on this. Uh, Wedge is, is proceeding along and we'll have more updates on the milestones as we go. Thanks a lot.